we want to talk about careers in physics and we'll come to that but before we get there we want to talk about the different sub disciplines of, of physics well this would need a very very long answer <laughs> but since time is short i would say i think the biggest things have been the fact that you have this state of the system i'm not a condensed matter experimental theorist or an experimentalist but i'll give my outside of view of it it's just the fact that you know people thought that if you understand the basics of one particle or uh, one fundamental entity then you'd be able to build on everything as a sum of all the things you know lots of particles coming together but when lots of particles come together new effects emerge which is exemplified by condensed matter physics and not just condensed matter physics but condensed matter science now there are lots of aspects to it for example the traditional condensed matter what's called hard condensed matter crystals and glasses and so on and then there is soft condensed matter and then there is even this exotic subject which is now becoming very very common is called quantum materials where you really see quantum effects in their full glory 